Jesus Christ, today I'm going to read the Bible story. 28th chapter, Nahamant met God. Sir? Nahamant was a great man, army commander in Syria. He was a brave soldier, but he had a troubled skin. This is called Lepros. Naaman's Israel servant, Gol, Gol said, Go see the prophet Elisha in Israel. Naaman's Israel servant, oh sorry, he can heal you. Naaman took many gifts gift, and with him. He told the king he can heal you. Naaman took many gifts, gifts with him. He took the king's messenger to the king of Israel. He reached Eli Eli Elisha's home by his chariot. chariot. Elisha sent out a man with a message. Wash your face seven times in the Jordan in the Jordan you will have, you will be healed oh it's like Elia Elijah he's saying like Elijah see like oh it's to Elisa wow <laughs> Elisa yeah, I think he's Elisa not Elisa sent out a man I think he's not a man I think he's Elisa <laughs> At first, Naaman was mad at Elisa. Elisha. He thought it was a silly thing to do. Elisha doesn't even come out to see me. He doesn't even pray for me. In the name of the Lord. He doesn't even touch me. Jordan is not the only river. Naaman was mad and tried it to go back home. Oh, his, on his way home, his servant told him, Please go to the Jordan River. This is not a hard thing to do. You just need to wash yourself. Naaman went to the Jordan as Elisa said. He washed it himself seven times. Naaman's skin became clean like that of a child. His skin disease was gone. Wow, there's a one fish there also. <laughs> well, he is very different. Naaman was very happy. Naaman came back to Elisa. Elisha. He tried it to give Elisha gift. Elisha didn't keep the gifts. 
Elisha told him to soul serve God. Naaman was healed. He did what Elisha said. Elisha told about God. Hmm? He's Elisha. Elisha. And that was that was the name. It is looking very same. No, I think it is all same. Twenty-nine chapter. Joash re prepared the temple. King Joash loved God. He didn't want God pleased. He wanted his people do what God pleased. He wanted his people come to God's temple often. God's temple was not in good shape. People didn't take good care of the temple. I have to prepare repair the house of God. King Joash made up his mind to repair it. I need money to do it. Make a big box to collect offerings and put it outside the temple. The King Joash commanded. Well, that is a very... I think that will not work. <laughs> they have made very good, right? People were happy to repair the temple. They brought offerings. When the box was full, King's servants took the offerings out and put the back box again. King Joash collected a lot of money to repair the temple. People were happy to help repair the temple. Wow. They're happy, but when they were not happy, God will also not like it, right? They are happy to help and repair the temple. So God is happy, but when they don't like to repair the temple and they don't want to help repairing the temple, they're giving offerings not good, then God will mm, God will be sad, right? Unhappy. King Josh gave the money to the workers. He heard my sons and Repenters, he heard workers from metal work. They worked it very hard. They repaired the temple very well. They rebuilt the temple of God according to its original design. Sing. The temple is very different. First time it was like there's a spider and there's a crack, right? And there's a spider. But now they they have helped it and give our offerings and good heart so they made the temple like this 
It is very nice temple. Thirty chapter, building a new wall. Nehemiah was a servant of a Persian king. One day, Nehemiah heard some sad news at the palace. The wall of Jerusalem was broken down. The gates of Jerusalem were burned. Ne Nehemiah cried several days. He prayed without eating anything. The king asked Nehemiah, What are you so sad? Nehemiah answered, The temple of God is my country. Temple of God in my country is ruined. The gates of the city are burned with fire. I think he will be very sad. <laughs> the king liked Nyamyan. The king was worried. He asked Nyamyan, what? Do you want me to do for you? Naaman answered, Send me home. Please allow me to rebuild a wall. I think Naaman was a very good person and he had listened to the king well, so the king liked Naaman. But when someone is not like it will he'll not send Naaman. The king gave Naaman blocks to build a wall. He took a bricks returned home. Some people didn't want to rebuild the wall. Then Baal of Tobia were very angry at the idea. They laughed it at the people of Israel. They tried to hurt Nyamia. They tried to hurt the helpers of Nyamia. They didn't want to rebuild the wall. God helped Nyamia build the wall. God helped Nyamia to put up the gates of the city. Nyamia did what God wanted him to do. It was not easy to rebuild the wall. They re Built the wall with God's help. The friends of Nyamia came to see the wall. They thanked God for helping Nyamia. They thanked God for making Nyamia rebuild the wall. Wow, Nyamia have build a wall yeah next time i will read the brief and beautiful queen esther actually some of the mm, yeah <laughs> next time i will read 31 chapter the brave and beautiful queen yes it was fun then bye next time i will read more stories. Bye!